are we looking at? We're looking at some sunshine returning this afternoon. How's that? Nice. After Finally. a wild day yesterday in some locations. So, hi, everybody. On this Friday afternoon, let's check out some of these rainfall amounts. Wow, Nantucket, four and a half inches. Fairhaven getting close to four inches. Pembroke, three and a half. Edgartown getting close to three and a half. Harwich, about three inches. Still raining on the most outer part of Cape Cod, but it's much lighter down there right now. It will be ending shortly, and we'll start to see a drying out process. Clearing coming in from the west. Already we're looking at this system way out in the Midwest to give us some scattered showers tomorrow. No big deal out of that. But this afternoon, through about 5 o'clock, the National Weather Service has a wind advisory up for southeastern Mass, especially the Cape and especially the islands where some gusts could go 40 to 50 with some maybe some isolated damage and outages there. As far as the 24-hour temperature change, look how much cooler it is this afternoon than it was yesterday afternoon this time, especially across southern New England, near and south of the Mass Pike. It's all in the 50s now, so it is going to be a chilly afternoon, even though it starts to brighten up and the sun comes out later. There's a lot of chilly air off to the north and west, so that's new weather pattern featuring mainly cool times ahead. Then after it clears out this afternoon, it'll become cloudy again late tonight. Lows around 48 in Boston, and that'll be the first time it's gone below 50 degrees in Boston since June 5th. That is a very long time. 40s in all the suburbs, and you can see some of the lows which are expected. Low to mid 40s in the suburbs, about 47, 48 maybe in Boston tonight. And then only going up to the lower 50s tomorrow, maybe 52, possibly as high as 54 in a few spots. And even across most of the nations on the cool side, the warm air has been shoved all the way to the south. And there's a system which may give us a couple of showers tomorrow. It's just an upper level system. There's no surface storm center at all. Unlike what's going on with the remnants of Michael here moving out rapidly and causing a lot of wind on his backside, but clearing out this afternoon. Then some clouds starting to show up tonight. And then tomorrow we get these scattered showers coming around in some locations for tomorrow. So for the games at Fenway Park, Cool breeze, 48 Sunday, Saturday night's game, 55, lots of clouds around for Sunday night's game. As far as the Pats go, also on Sunday evening, 58 for tailgating, about 50 for a kickoff, and around fourth quarter, closer to around 50 degrees. Here's your forecast next seven days. All you see is some cool weather there, near or slightly below average temperatures when we had that, and a whole seven-day forecast, Chris.